The rumors are true, the post reads. It's with an agonizingly sad heart that the John Curtin Hotel's time on this earth will come to an end. The owners of the almost 150-year-old building have decided to sell, making way, most likely, for apartments. The team behind the long-standing pub and live music venue took to Instagram this afternoon to share the shattering news. We have a lease until the end of November this year, the post goes on. Beyond that, we have no idea what the developers will have planned for us. Named after Australian politician John Curtin, who served as Prime Minister in the 1940s, the Curtin is a pub's pub, casual, inexpensive, and unashamedly dive why in the best possible way. It also became worth a visit just to eat at Sonny's Fried Chicken and Burgers, the in-house American-style diner, the fried chicken is some of the best in town, and so are the stacked cheeseburgers. It's also importantly a mainstay of Melbourne's live music scene, with gig posters dating back decades lining the walls. So, its closure will be a massive blow for the city's music community. The Curtain's upstairs bandroom is one of few in Melbourne that can just as easily accommodate a local up and comers Tuesday night gig as it can an established band's album launch and even an international festival sideshow. So, the team full of fierce supporters of live music in Melbourne is appealing to local talent to reach out if they want to take to the stage while they still can. If you have never played but would like to, if you sold out the room and would like to do it again, if you want to claim your piece of history bands, now is your time.